Okay, good day folks. I got an interesting one today in regards to the wine skins, which a lot of folks already know about, but I wanted to take a closer look. And um, you know how sometimes you search for stuff like on eBay or whatever, like I looked at for Berenstain Bears books on eBay, and it says, instead of saying, you know, it, it says, most of them it says what it says now, stain, but um, some of them actually said Berenstain slash Berenstain just in case people were looking for it. Why would they do that? Hmm. Now look at this. Patches, it says right here, patches and wineskins. And then it gives you two other references. Okay, I'll show you what I did. I looked it up in my own Bible. I have a King James Bible right here. This is my minister's Bible. I've had for a long time. KJV, okay. It's a really good Bible. Um, I'll show you what I'm doing here. Matthew 9. Matthew 9, King James Bible. Then you go down to... Where is it? Patches and wineskins, okay? This is wineskins right here. Patch, new cloth, an old garment. For that which is put in... You know, I'll take it. Neither do men put bottles. Okay, but up here in the title it says patches and wineskins. Okay, now you look up these other two. So you look in the actual Bible and it says bottles here bottles here and bottles here okay so make a video really short I'm not going to show it to you actually I should I will okay here Luke 5 36 okay Luke 5 36 uh, bottles okay another one is Mark 2 21 Skins. Matthew 9. 16. One more. Bottles. Three Gospels, but the title says Wineskins. Okay. Um, actually, I never noticed the titles on these other ones. I didn't look at that. I think that they all had. You know, they say stuff up here. This Bible doesn't actually say the titles above them. Like, sometimes they have several titles, but this one doesn't. So, anyways, another interesting thing. Patches and the skins. Um, so, anyways, I was downtown like I always am. I gave you a quick nugget about how it is good to believe the truth as much as it's not fun. To, it's gross, tough, because the devil's a liar and he's hurting us really bad. Or he's hitting us really bad anyway. It's just shaking that real Christians are going to get through and other people are going to, they're not going to know what to do. They're going to keep going along with the Bible, which um, for right now it's fine, but you know what I'm saying? It's, it's, you just got to be careful. Anyway, but uh, I was downtown and street preaching or just actually sharing just tracks and just wearing my t-shirt and passing out lots of tracks. It was really kind of a gentle time. And my ending time was a really nice black guy. He's a, he tells me he's from the black Israelites and um it was so funny we had the longest debate i mean it's like i couldn't disagree more with a racial dividing version of biblical believers which is just it's almost enough to make you want to die but this guy was so polite he was actually very kind and he was pretty smart about the bible but i it was when i told him about the mandela effect that all of a sudden we started to kind of like band together he totally got it i showed him the cern thing i understood explain that whole thing to him how the very people who made the www bob 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 six 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 like the little slashes on monster um deal um remember the monster um deal there it has the bob 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 symbol for the scratching on the can but anyways i, I explained it that to him the cern symbol is six 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 and the as above so below thing and everything and he was like totally getting it and i don't even know if he even understands all that he just knows for sure about the vatican and whatever because the um a lot of different strange groups they actually do know about the strange challenges that are going on like we agreed about the Vatican and whatnot so anyways it was when I told him that that he said he kind of like warned me he's like wow you, you know you, you could tell I really had his attention like wow the Bible's changing what what is the truth then and I said though his word will never pass and his word is written in glory his word has always been written in glory his opinion is who he is and what he what he thinks about anything 
being a sovereign God, totally in control, and totally is what he is. He said, I am that I am, period. And whatever I think about anything, that's the word. You know, and that's, it's holy, it's serious. So thank God for the word of God. We're so still lucky to have it. But he understood that, and it was just amazing how after that I really had his attention. And it, that was what really caused him to question himself. You know, do I really know the truth? And he's like, well, you haven't converted me yet. But uh, just just so you know, I, might, you, you know, I really want to check this stuff out. So anyways, that's just another one I just thought. It does say wineskins right there, but it doesn't say wineskins anywhere in the text as far as I'm seeing. So if you know something I don't know, then go ahead and let me know. But uh, <laughs> hello.